Hey everybody, this is a uh, Russell here from. Oh, sorry, Joel Shaky. Russell here from Air Beards Outdoor Adventures, and here I have a Thompson Center Arms 50 cal Firehawk. Um, <laughs> a long story on this. My dad took it out hunting. I don't know how many years ago. It's been over. It's been probably 10 years or so ago, and never shot it. He took it out, had it loaded, never shot it. Well, then a few years later, with the same charge still in it, I wanted to go out. And so very close family friend and I got the charge out of there. Well, I'll take that back. Rewind a bit. I'm selling that wrong. Uh, my dad had left the gun at the family friend's house that I'm talking about, and he had shot it and got the charge out of there just on some random day, and I decided I wanted to hunt with it, never had before, took it out, well we cleaned it, took it out the next day, wouldn't go off, I don't know if you can see me, it wouldn't go off, I shot her to doe three different times with the cap. Wouldn't go, wouldn't go, wouldn't go. Anyway, so I brought it home, did the same horrible thing, left the charge in there for a couple of years. Then I decided to see if it would shoot one day. Took it out on the same back deck and it shot. And then it sat neglected again for years. And finally the other day, well, two years ago, actually, I took it all apart and that was it. I quit messing with it. And then the last week, I've cleaned it up as best as I possibly can. Got it looking pretty good. Put a new nipple on there. Whatnot. I've got it loaded with Pyrodex. 125 grains of it. And I couldn't tell you the... Um, brand of the Savit and the bullet that I have in there. There's just some stuff my dad had. I have some brand new stuff that I'll use in it, but I just decided to use this. So here, I'm going to test fire it. There's a pumpkin all the way down to the bottom of the yard sitting on a very well, perfectly fine bucket. So I figured maybe I'll hit the pumpkin and not the bucket. This is open sights. I have no clue where these sights sit, if it's even in sight, or what. I'm, my goal is to hit the bucket, or hit the pumpkin, or close to the pumpkin on that cardboard background, and not my perfectly fine bucket. So that's my incentive to not shoot my bucket. So I'm gonna load my cap on here. And I probably should have started with a, a lower powder charge to make sure the dang thing's not gonna blow up on my face. I everything to my knowledge is tight, you know, cleaned up tight. Put back together the way it should be. This looks like the nipple I bought may not be the right size of nipple. Yeah, it is. All right, folks. I'll see if I'll hit the bucket. Let me make sure my camera is still on the pumpkin. Let's see if I hit the bucket or the pumpkin. Move stuff out of my way here. use this table or the railing of the porch sorry my porch is real wobbly oh kind of scared for me not the bucket
Well, pretty sure I pulled my shot. I don't know. I can't see if I... Well, my bucket looks to be in one piece. But I can't tell where I hit. Well, anyway. I'm going to go down and investigate. And uh, see, see what the collateral damage is. If it's even anything. Thanks for watching, folks. Oh, come on.